oh, afternoon. Uh, kind of the same sort of walk as the other day when I was walking back from a, a shift at Budgeons, except the clouds are over and it's a little bit colder today. But uh, yeah, just been down outside Budgeons, helping people get into the uh, the shop, helping them control their numbers so that they can uh, continue to trade safely and see the delight on people's faces when they said uh, when i was able to say oh yeah i think they've got eggs um because we're still in shortage of some things but uh just a quick i'd say wandering home to do evening prayer on zoom with anyone that joins in the link is on the facebook page it stays the same for the next couple of weeks up until easter and um just to say that yeah prayers and thoughts remain with all all in isolation, um, all who are grieving loss at the moment, and we already know of some in our locality, and um, and for those who are just worried about relatives in hospital or who are ill, and those who are worried for themselves, self-isolating, there was a, a lady this afternoon who just had to come out to get what she needed, uh, despite the fact of her vulnerability, so... Um, yeah, we're meeting people who are in really testing times and uh, we know that and we, we share in that with them but um, yeah, so we will be praying this evening and praying morning and evening prayer which includes specific prayers for the situation every day and as part of my exercise over the next couple of days if I'm not walking down to Budgeons I will aim to walk around some of the streets closer to the vicarage to be obedient to the intent of everything the government's trying to do um, but uh, we'll walk around those streets and try and find places where I have a view over a bit more of the parish um, because it'd be good just to be able to look out over the locality as I pray and um, I know that you're held in my prayers it was just uh, a reflection while stood outside the shop I do just wonder how long it'll be once things go back to normal. For how long we'll hold on to an appreciation of some of the stuff that we are going to get back in due course. How long we'll appreciate it for and how long it'll take for us to just get to the point where we go, oh, that's routine and it's all back to normal again. Yeah, to be able to gather with friends, to share meals with all sorts of people, to just go out and spend time in proximity in a social environment so as i say playing on my mind at the moment that perhaps we have a real opportunity coming up to truly appreciate what we have and it's something that's denied to so many because of regimes that they live under and things like that and perhaps think of this time of isolation as a lesson to us all um, in what it can be like for other people but anyway that's probably for later at the moment. No, my thoughts and prayers are with you. God bless. And I'll speak to you again soon. Goodbye.